the Reading Lacrosse Association would like to congratulate Jimmy Queenie for being the first Reading High School lacrosse player to be elected to the school's Hall of Fame. Athletically and academically, few student athletes have reached the heights of excellence attained by RMHS Class of 2009's James Queenie. In the classroom and on the football and lacrosse fields, Queenie put together a high school and collegiate career for the ages. Queenie is quite simply the best boys lacrosse player Reading High has ever had. He was a two-time captain, a four-year starter, and a Middlesex League All-Star all four years. He was a two-time Middlesex League MVP and Boston Herald and Boston Globe All-Scholastic in both his junior and senior seasons. He was also Reading's first All-American for boys lacrosse and remains the only player to win that elite honor twice. At the time of his induction, he is the Reading High Boys Lacrosse Program's all-time leading scorer and holds RMHS records for goals and assists in a season and in a career. On the football field, Queenie was a terrific two-way threat at tight end and linebacker. First breaking in as the team's punter in his sophomore year in 2006, Queenie started on both sides of the ball as a junior. He led the receiving core of a talented but young 2007 team and finished fourth on the team with 56 tackles at linebacker, earning his first of two Middlesex League All-Star honors. Although they finished just four and seven in 2007, the Rockets were talented and clearly going places, and Queenie and company delivered in 2008. That year, Redding won the Middlesex League and completed an 11-0 regular season, including an epic 14-7 win at home in Week 10 over then-unbeaten Melrose. The 6'2", 195-pound senior captain led the team with 35 catches for 526 yards and three touchdowns, and at middle linebacker, finished second on the team with 67 tackles, two and a half sacks, and an interception. He was also a terrific blocker and helped pave the way for big rushing seasons by tailbacks Tino Perina and Ryan Pollock. Although Redding's season came to an end in the playoffs with a tough 20-12 loss at home to eventual Super Bowl champion Walpole, its 11-1 season and the incredible momentum it generated paved the path for a 2009 team that would win it all. The postseason accolades rolled in, including Middlesex League All-Star, Boston Globe All-Scholastic, Boston Herald All-Scholastic, Daily Times Chronicle Defensive Player of the Year, and National Football Foundation and Hall of Fame Scholar Athlete Award. Queenie was also chosen to play in the elite Shriners All-Star Classic. As great as Queenie's accomplishments were on the gridiron, he took his game up a notch on the lacrosse field. At the time, lacrosse was somewhat of a new sport at Reading High. In 2006, Queenie's freshman year, it was in just its sixth year of existence as a varsity program. But the new, unknown program quickly began to soar with Queenie leading the attack. Queenie not only started as a freshman, but earned his first of four league all-star honors while leading the team in scoring, including an eight-point game in an 11-8 win over Wakefield that opened the eyes of his teammates and the Middlesex League. In each of the next three seasons, Queenie was the leading scorer at Reading High and the leading scorer in the Middlesex League. In 2008, his junior year, the Rockets finished 15-3 during the regular season, 18-4 overall, and advanced to the semifinals of the East Division II tournament. That year, Queenie tallied five goals and an assist in a crucial 11-10 win over defending Middlesex League champion Lexington helping the Rockets secure their first of two Middlesex League championship seasons. Redding later advanced to the Division II East semifinal with a thrilling 15-13 win over King Philip before bowing out in the tournament. The next year, Queenie's 2009 senior season surpassed all expectations. The Rockets finished the regular season with a perfect 18-0 record, 
In tournament play, Redding blew out Wilmington 16-3 in the preliminary round, crushed Shaoxin 20-4 in the first round, and survived a wild 9-8 overtime win over Hingham to advance to the East semifinals. Redding took an early lead over Walpole and appeared to be on the verge of breaking through to its first ever trip to the Division II East Finals. But a crushing 10-9 overtime defeat ended both its season at 21-1 and Queenie's career with the Rockets. Despite the defeat, Queenie had helped put the Redding lacrosse program on the map, dethroning traditional powerhouses Winchester and Lexington and establishing the Rockets as the team to beat in the Middlesex League after just nine years of existence and where it still stands today as a league and state power. Queenie finished his senior year with 73 goals and 69 assists for 142 points. For his career, he amassed 392 total points, 236 goals, 156 assists, was named Daily Times Chronicle Lacrosse Player of the Year three times, was a two-time Boston Globe and Boston Herald All-Scholastic, and was twice named All-American. His work ethic, lacrosse skills, and leadership traits set the standard for all Reading lacrosse players to follow, said head coach Charlie Hardy. I have to throw him off the field every day. He just wants to get better, and when his teammates see that, it's contagious. He is, without a doubt, our Larry Bird. Even as he dominated the field of play, Queenie excelled in the classroom. He graduated RMHS as class valedictorian, ranked number one out of 310 graduating students. He was a two-time Boston Globe Phelps District B top scholar athlete in Massachusetts and a national AP Scholar Award winner. After graduation, Queenie attended Colgate where he continued on a similar path of academic and athletic accomplishment. Queenie was a three-year starter on defense and two-year captain for the Raiders, helping lead the team to the NCAA quarterfinals. He was named a USILA Academic All-American, a Capital One Academic All-American twice, and was Colgate's Scholar Athlete of the Year. A double major in math and mathematical economics, Queenie again graduated as valedictorian, ranked number one out of 685 graduates in the Colgate class of 2013. Today, Queenie is a graduate researcher at BU and a PhD candidate in systems engineering. In his near 30-year career of coaching at RMHS, head football coach John Fiore said, quote, only a very small group of student athletes can be remotely compared to his accomplishments on the field and in the classroom. The RMHS Athletic Hall of Fame is a place where we celebrate our greatest student athletes. It is incomplete without James Queenie. It no longer is, coach. The RMHS Athletic Hall of Fame proudly welcomes James Queenie, RMHS Class of 2009.